Welcome back to my Let's Play for Pokemon Emerald, my Mono Dark run. It's time to head into our friendly Granite Cave here. I guess I might as well ask about, you know, Flash while we're here, you know. <sighs> After all, it would help us, but I don't think any of our Pokemon can learn it, so we're just going to go on without it. Um, I guess I can check and see if Mudkip can learn it. I mean, a lot of Pokemon can pick up Flash. It's, you know, not the most impossible of moves to know. I mean, it's not as common as Toxic, but pretty much every Pokemon can learn that one. A wild Geodude, eh? That's not a dude, it's a dudette. I mean, come on. It's a female Geodude. I'm not sure how you'd tell the difference, to be honest, because they all look the same. As far as I'm aware, there's no gender differences between a male and female Geodude. Hmm. <laughs> oh, whatever. Let's just pust out on our um, HM move here and see if we can um, give it to Mudkip. Oh, I can give it the dots? I'm not giving dots flash. That's a waste of my time. After all, I have far better uses for those move slots. <sighs> so I guess we're just going to go without. Oh well. I welcome the darkness to surround me anyway. After all, I'm a Dark type trainer. I'm used to the dark. So is this thing gonna do another um, mud sport? Why would you dude care if electricity's power is weakened anyway? It's a geo dude. It's ground type. It doesn't have to worry about electricity. Like I guess that's meant to be more of a team move, but gosh darn it! Like who would you team it up with that you know would be super vulnerable? Like you gotta. Pair up a Geodude with, you know, uh, a flying type, I guess, so, you know, it can avoid earthquake attacks, maybe? I guess you could do that. Just, ugh. Well, that's a steel type, and so I think they resist dark type attacks, so let's just move on. Okay, let's see. Ooh, a Pokeball. Right, literally, well, I, I figured it'd honestly be an item ball, but nope. Well, let's see. I gotta be getting closer. Of course, I'm not sure what floor Sableye's on. Ooh, level 9. Number 9? Ah, uh, what the? Outsped me? I guess I can't be too surprised, but kind of annoyed about that. <sighs> Could have at least done me the favor of failing. Ooh, Sableye. Nice. Well, let's get to it. Um, first things first. Let's tackle it. Oh yeah, it's a ghost type. Doy. Well, I guess we're gonna have to switch over to biting it. Okay, I think we can bite one more time, so if we don't crit, we should be good, and I can start trying to put this thing in a ball. Oh no, it's leering at me? Ugh, I, I guess we're in heat or something, it wants to really get a sniff. Ugh, well, let's um just put in a ball real fast before it does anything I don't want to think about. I guess we'll go with the Premier Ball. I know, I know, it's effectively just a free Pokeball that just looks cool. Darn it! Nightshade! Well, now, let's try a Great Ball. They are great, after all. Not as good as an Ultra Ball. And they're complete crap compared to a Master Ball, but that's true for every Pokeball. I mean, let's face it, it's a Master Ball. If you want a ton of those, go play Shaman King, you know, Sprinting Wolf. Or a Soaring Hawk version. There you can, you know, buy Master Balls as much as you like. Um. I don't know. What to call you. Well, I don't have anything uh, up my sleeve right now. Darn it. Well, since you're part ghost, I guess we'll go with, um, Casper. I mean, that's the best I can come up with. Casper the Friendly Ghost. Who's also Dark-type. Because, you know, reasons. 
This is a very emo Casper, okay? I had to listen to all that Lincoln Park, you know, before he died. Well, let's let's run away and keep moving. After all, we're almost done with this place, I think. Break some rocks. Okay, stairs. Where are you? Where are you at, Steven? I think you're around here somewhere. I just want to get out of here now. Unless you want to throw some more Pokemon at me, I can easily crush, you know? That'd be a nice game. Ah, I feel like I need to activate my repel at this point. To save my sanity. <sighs> Darn, Zubat, why couldn't you have been retyped and I could have a dark crowbat? A dark bat. A dark knight, as it were. Shoot. Ugh, like, I'm getting really annoyed with all these freaking steel types showing up. You know, if I was doing a different run, I'd probably feel honored, but for this team, I really don't want them. An Everstone, eh? Well, that's useless. I can't think of any Pokemon I'd have on this team I wouldn't want to evolve. Ooh, a level 10 Abra. It's definitely gonna be too fast. Yeah, I fear it flee. I mean, what else is Abra gonna do, you know? Well, can I go up and around this place, though? And you stupid little Mel Midgets, would you go away? I'm not interested in fighting you. You're too hard on my teeth. Okay. I think you can just have to take that one. <sighs> Took a while to get through there in the dark, but that's just how it goes. Of course, I also need to gain some levels before we go and take on that gym leader, I assume. So, after this, I'm probably going to have to take a break and do some grinding. Probably using Nightshade. Well, at least it does set damage. Oh, crap. It's a, it's a, a sumo wrestler. I can't fight sumos. You might know, you know, a, an annoying fighting type move. Yes, I know you're Steven. I, I came here with a message. Now, will you please take the message and, you know, do whatever it says. Hey, thank you. Let me see. I'll give you this TM. Kane's my favorite move. Steel Wing. Well, I don't have any use for Steel Wing. I don't have any Pokemon that can learn it. <sighs> Jeez. And even if I did have a Pokemon I can learn it, I honestly don't know if I'd want to give it to him anyway. Oh, well, we'll be seeing Steven again later, I'm sure. And as soon as I try and leave, I get jumped again, huh? It figures. I think I'd be used to it by now. Well, let's um, continue to work on those um level ups. Oh, of course, I became confused. Great. Let's just bite our way through this thing. Uh, just a few more levels, and we'll be be free to do what we really want to do. You know. Suppose I could try grinding on um some Geo dudes in here. That's not the ideal target. Well, now let's see. Let's send out Casper. I know you're almost dead, Casper, but I usually get out there and teach this fighting Pokemon a lesson that can't mess with you. Well, let's Nightshade. What? It's probably the best move I have at the moment. Well, darn. I think it's like, I can't do anything to you. I can't throw sand in your face. I can't punch you. What am I supposed to do? You're supposed to lay down and die. That's what you do, man. You're to give up. You're to give in to despair. And forfeit your life to Casper. Well, I'll do for this episode. Next time I know, we'll be, um, heading to the gym. Which, 
may or may not be a challenge for us. I don't know. Depends on what sort of moves Brawly has, I suppose. <laughs> Till then, see ya.